Hey there folks, and welcome back to Italy and Europa Universalis for the Mare Nostrum expansion. So in the last episode we were sort of consolidating from, uh, from our last war with the Ottomans and kind of getting ready for our next war with France. Um, let's see, the last thing we've done was we were coming back from France. Oh right, I was going to get a claim on Artois. For that upcoming war, we're also getting claims on Spain. Yeah, I think Cantabria would be a good next target. What else was it? Oh, right. Value of sugar has gone uh, like sky high. So I think what I'm going to do here actually is Not that one. There we go. Build a plantation in Nablus. And Alexandria's got spices. Indeed. Uh, and I was always also looking around. I could have sworn I got rid of a fort in Trent, but apparently I was wrong. Let's, since it's already given to the nobility, let's build a training field there. I probably did something idiotic. Well, I'll just build a barracks there for now. Oh, fair. All right, that's that's why. So that's being built. Probably did something idiotic, like got rid of a different building that was there. That sounds like something I might have dude. Right, are there any other forts that just don't seem like we need them now? Uh, honestly, Corfu here is probably not necessary. Probably went stupid and destroyed like a church in Trent or something. Guess I'll leave, I'll leave that one for now. Let's get rid of this castle in Adirn. Just. Just trying to save money. All right, we've got a fort there, fort there. Let's get rid of this one as well. All right, are we? Yeah, that dropped us down to only 0.2 from fully maintained forts. Well, hey, that's fine. Increased our money though by quite a bit. And I'm also thinking about. We've got a huge chunk of the Genoa node now. I think because we have comparatively little in the English Channel and we're not really going to fight about it, I am tempted. I'm sorely tempted to, uh,. Make some boats. Make some light ships, we'll join them all together, and then we'll just send all of that to the English Channel. The way you know considers Hungary's arrival. That's that's all fair and fine. Right. Right, we have discontent being sown, so I don't really want to lose legitimacy. Definitely no. Definitely no, definitely no, definitely no. Oh, and Bohemia got themselves... Yeah, they got themselves a uh, an heir. 346, because why, why wouldn't it be? Alright, Holland. Let's get that claim, shall we? Interesting. That's right, we do still have the, uh, the guy. 
you know, the guy who does the stuff. Right, an army reformer is what we had. He's now deceased. For defense. Eh. Two commandants, really. Uh, you know what? I'm just gonna I'm gonna hire a commandant. I know it's only plus one, but yeah, we're 13 years ahead. I'm I'm fine with it. A new flagship fleet can't be complete without a glorious flagship, so I lose 50 ducats. I gain five prestige. Okay, all right, all right. No matter what, we get a free ship. Uh, yeah, I'll take a frigate. Max our, uh... That is inconvenient. Right, right. We've got Portuguese separatists still to deal with. Bulgarian separatists. Nothing really down here anymore, so I guess you head to Burgas. And these are kind of taken care of. So, one of you go there, one of you go there, one of you go there, one of you go there. Maybe we can take care of that, because we bumped up autonomy in the Azores. Indeed, we did. Alright. Out of curiosity, if I put, like, Valencia over to the burgers, it's going to increase her influence over 55, yeah. about this. Obviously that doesn't boost it nearly as much. Yeah, sure. Let's let's do that. Axos we have dealt with, so you can head to... What are the issues here with the Bulgarian Separatists? Sofia, alright. Head there. Persia sent the Ottomans a gift. Very, very interesting, all this, all this gift-giving. Alright, those are trending down, those are trending down. We've still got these. Hmm. Which we'll probably look into firing, in all honesty. Whoop. Oh. Military leader died, alright. Emiya is in a war, alright. A war against Russia, you say? Well, Russia's... To be fair, Russia is busy. I don't think I can get a claim here and then attack in time. Oh crap, I've gone too far on Spain in terms of points.
Oh well. I wasted a month or two, so it goes. <laughs> yeah, I don't think going after that is necessary or worthwhile or any of that kind of stuff. Money-wise, we are A-OK. -okay. Alright. Force limit-wise, we're A-OK. -okay. Spain is taking money from people, because it's what they do. Spain has announced Ayutthaya as their new rival. Where are they at over here? Ah, there they are. Well, okay then. The neighbors are going to sort themselves out. We'll send them... It's fine. Lubeck will see to Bornholm in Scandinavia. Alright. Uh, we'll send the navies to uh, to join up in protecting trade in Genoa, and then we'll just send them all to the English Channel, probably. Justified demands has gone away. Unfortunate. Our army isn't so grand. I could lose the stability, or I could pay 10% more for infantry and cav. For five years. Ugh. Yeah, that's, that's not cheap. Decidedly not cheap. Fifteen point eight. Yeah. You know what? The Azores are basically just a tax thing anyway. So yeah, that'll we'll keep the clergy off our back for a while yet. Parallel authority. Authority. So, burgers gain 15 loyalty and 10 influence. Clergy loses 15 loyalty. I uh, can just swing that. I mean, obviously this will put us in negative tax for a little while, but we can get out from under reasonably, reasonably quickly. So that's for 15 years. And, alright, that might mean we have to wait a little while on this, but, sure. Giopi has announced Ottomans as their new rival. Well, alright then. Well, alright then. Money is still pouring in. Chinoa is now allied with Galicia. Interesting. Right, you guys protect trade in Genoa. No longer claim Savoy. Portugal is claiming Gibraltar. Concerning. Rex is done in Trent. I see. Well, that's that's not it's not a lot of a war. Wait, what? Spain can do much of anything against France. 
honestly, France can just single-handedly stomp all of that, so it's not... It's not much of a war. Truth be told. Okay, trade in Genoa. Wait, what? I mean, us being papal controller is great and all, but... What? Plus one yearly prestige, minus five tech cost, minus 20% aggressive expansion impact. I mean, that's all nice, but does that mean the Pope exists again? Interesting. Right, all kind of new advisors. Sure, sure. All right, well, let's keep relations high with our one ally, shall we? All right, let's also grab another round of boats. Wait, no, that's not what I was looking for. There we go. That'll work. Alright, Holland. We want to claim on Artois. And then get out of there. Yeah, go back to go back to the spy network on France. Didn't even pay attention, that grows at 1.85. Very nice. This unhappiness, it doesn't seem to be in too, too bad of a shape. So much of this would just, just be done if we didn't have that plus three going on. Silly Spain, why well, you gotta be this way? See. Are you saying England has more heavies than us? Well then. That's that's actually a mission we can do something about. I know I was getting rid of heavies before, but given this new information, I think I can take it upon myself to, uh, to build another couple. There we go. There we go. I knew there was a grand shipyard somewhere around over here. Right, we've converted Naxos. Let's start on Sofia. Arriving, everything is uh, is going as it should. It's seen this is the Bulgarian separatists, indeed. Wait, that's that's not the button I wanted. Yep, Fergus, go go. And we're still we're still at a hundred. And 100 religious unity. It's 
It's a good thing. What a time to be alive, etc., etc. Right, we we would be paying three ninety four. That's it's not expensive. Decidedly not expensive. Now what I'm not following, necessarily, is uh, is whether we were actually elected or if it's just the fact that we own Rome. Now, I assume it's the fact that we were elected. Uh, so I could, I could go for the spy network construction guy, but... I mean, this is going to put us back to having, uh, to, to gaining zero points, but sure, that'll work. I guess it's not actually true. We'll be gaining very few points, but we will be gaining some. All right. So, we can demand their support again. Alright, I can grant them charters. No, I probably just want to do the Admiral, I guess. That's probably going to be the best, best way to go about that. Oh, right, I forgot to get to replace the General. There we go. 6212, that'll work. We will get ourselves an Admiral. There we go, 75%, and yeah, demand support. Good deal. Alright, I like I like where we're at then, and then this will be 17, 16. Good, 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 good. Alright. Uh, how long are we talking about on these integrations? 1720, this will actually come in 1712. Presumably it'll come in slightly faster than that. Which will of course slow down Burgundy yet again. But hey, that's still, still pretty good. There we go. Boats are still coming in. That, that did not take long. Wow. All right, who is still pissy? Bessarabia, Soinka, Almeria, Toledo. Yes, you can head to Bessarabia. You can actually head over this way. That, that'll all go away when this does. In August of 05. Alright. I like it. Oh. Nope. Almost. Almost went through the end of the month. Alright, Spain. 12, 11. Yeah, get a claim on Asturias. We go. Didn't actually waste points this time. Hooray! Diplomatic insult on Hungary. Or we can try to ease the tension. Well, sure, I'll ease tensions. Sounds good to me. Austria now actually really likes us again. Can I get it to 190? So plus 12 would be 58. 58 plus 25. Actually looks like I could get... Could get to 190. And then just start integrating them via points. I 
I mean, they're large, it'll take a while. If I think that it's... I mean, it's going to be a bit of a crapshoot trying to do it through Diplo Rep, so yeah. Alright, we got Bohemia up to 130. Alright, we'll go through the end of the month anyway. Come on back. Alright, Austria. Alright, maybe I can't then, because I can't offer them access. So I can send them a gift, which would put us at 71, 71, 83 by the time we improve relations. Yeah, the problem is, well, no, no, we lose, lose five a year, we gain six. <laughs> so it's going to take quite some time, actually. Right. Is there any anything else here? I'm forgetting. Doesn't look like it. All right, well, hell. You know, let's improve relations with Bohemia again. The rainbow's building a spy network. Right, it's still a vassal, so. Not really anything we're going to be doing about it. Alright, money's still coming in. That's still looking good. Claims are coming in here. We still need to be working on... There we go. On Spain, because that truce is... 07. Yeah, yearly Navy tradition going up. Very nice. Thing. Are there any of these that don't look terrible? Move Salzburg from the map. Buy more on trade income. Nope, they all look terrible. Navies <laughs> have arrived in Rome. Combine all this together. Tech trade in Genoa. So it's 93 light ships I have there now. Right, I mean, we're getting very little improvement for these light ships. As it stands, I don't want to do another round of lights. Definitely could. How dare they? The bastards. Alright, let me know when you get to Rosetta. <sighs> Alright, fine. Annoying, but fine. Alright, go ahead and send them to improve relations in Austria then. quickly. Right, I could definitely assign a leader before you get there. Speed things up just a touch. In fact, go ahead and dive.
back to it. And let's see if we can end these. And unsurprisingly, we can. Good. Good. Alright folks, with that, I'm going to call this an episode. Thank you for watching, and I hope to see you in the next one where... Let's see, it's, it's January, right? January when the truce is up? Yeah, so I'm not going to get a claim on Lorraine. Hmm. Anyway, folks, see you next time.